love these Fridays because I get kind of down during the week with all the... Okay, my name is Martin Hewitt, for those of you who don't know me. And I've been running against Rodney Freelandheis in the establishment now for nine months. Um, I always like coming here on Fridays because it re-energizes me as to why I'm doing this. But today I just want to very quickly say a couple of things. One, some people have said to me today, would I ever take NRA money? No way in hell. I put that on Facebook. I put that on Twitter. And we've got to get away from big money buying candidates. That's the only thing to say on that. The other thing, well, there's a lot to say, but I'll try to keep it short. The other thing is that we have now successfully, through all of your efforts, gotten rid of Freeling Heisen next year, which is wonderful. But the job is only half done. We now have to worry about other Freeling Heisen clones taking his place being endorsed by the party. Worse, worse, or worse. Worse, worse. So although the job is partway done, it's not all the way done. So I want you all to consider as we progress in the next few weeks and months that we have to still fight hard to make sure that there is a moderate, or I will say liberal Republican, in the slot, <laughs> running. And all I ask of you is that you think about that in the future. And I will have some more town hall meetings. My next one as of right now is on March 12th and it's in Roseland. Roseland. At the and I am hoping you know, at the public library, and I will put that up shortly. I did have a, a town hall meeting this past week, and it was very interesting to talk to all the people there. One of the questions, they were all talking to me about gun control, and I turned it around and I said, okay, let's turn it all around. A year from now, I'm your congressperson. What would you want me to do to keep Morristown High School from getting shot up? So, you, you know, the thing is, they say it can't happen here, it can happen anywhere. We have to remain ever vigilant. And the gun problem is not a Democratic problem or a Republican problem. It's saving our children problem, pure and simple. Cool. So as we go forward, just keep those thoughts in mind. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.